Siobhan's feeling guilty about her wealth again, so sit down and look deserving. Come on, not a bad idea. No, I'm just so thankful for a refuge. Oh. What's the matter, post-wedding blues? No, more like total, utter chaos. What's wrong? Well, suffice it to say that Maggie's back in town. What? You're kidding. Yeah, I wish they were. Oh, and Roger and Delia are Ooh, back. Oh, boy, a real full house. So I thought it was a good idea to get Grace mm. out of there. Mm. 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 You uh, think maybe I should get over there? Uh, oh, no. <laughs> no, I no. <laughs> You're going to feel it all settled. We're all so glad to see you. It's so nice to have a pretty girl around this house. Mm. You having fun meeting all your new cousins, huh? Yes. You know, the next generation of Ryans is coming right up. They're going to take over in a couple of minutes. We're all here. What's, what's this, a meeting of the clan? Hey, Phil. Right. That's all. Uh, sorts. Well, you know, uh, i got to get back to business. Back to the office. I'll see you guys later. Bye. Mr. Moore. Frank. Bye. See you later, sweetie. Yeah. Goodbye, Frank. Can I kiss you? Bye. Yeah. Thank you. See you, Grace. All right, bye-bye. Uh, listen, i better go, too. Go back to your mama. i got to collect my Mary from Maeve, and I'll see you later. Yes, right? stop by. Okay. See ya. Boy, that Frank, he just he loves me. You know, he tries to hide it, but he can't fool me. <laughs> You're right. He loves you. What's up? Well, um, you see, I'm at crossroads here. It's fraught with potential, and I'm just standing here scratching my head, pondering the alternatives, and you can help. Scratching your head or pondering? Both. <laughs> hey, Grace, you know what? I know where I can lay my hands on a bag of very worn but very loved wooden blocks. Are you interested? Oh, not the ones I remember. Yeah, I don't think Ma's throwing them away. It hurt their feelings. Oh, huh? boy, we said that. that was a pleasure. They're upstairs. Come on. Yeah, we'll see, see you guys later. See you. See you, Now yeah, you're right. I like this weather better. Yeah, he's all right. So, tell me about the crossroads. Well, that's really very simple, because you're one of them. Oh, my God, it's you. And you. Are you still panting after my brother? <sighs> Maggie, I know how crotchety older women can be, but if you just let me see Ben, I'll be out of your way in five minutes. He's not here. And even if he were, I wouldn't let trash like you near him. Oh, look who's talking, Miss Trailer Park 1980. You wouldn't be so full of yourself if you knew where he was. Is he with Lizzie? Oh, poor Nancy Don. You just don't have what it takes, do you? Where are they, Maggie? I'm not telling you. This may be their last chance to reconcile. Well, let's see now. They're not here, and they can't be at Lizzie's apartment. The park. They're at Ben's painting place. No. Yes, the park. Give it up, Nancy Don. They'll never, ever get Ben away from Lizzie. You know, Maggie, it must be a horrible, horrible feeling losing your man to Delia. I'm warning you, Nancy Don. If you louse things up for Ben one more time, he'll kill you first. And I'll kill you second. Ben. I'm leaving town. Where are you going? Australia. Maggie just came back and she left Mama all by herself. Plus, uh, I don't want to watch Roger and Maggie duke it out with each other. That's a good idea. The real reason is... Uh, I can't stand watching you with John Reed and not me. Well, for your information, it's working out very well. Working out? Is that the best you can say about it? I don't have to explain anything to you. You know, Liz, there was a time when you didn't used to have to. We were so close, I could just read your mind just by looking in your eyes. I'm glad you're going. I mean, I think the distance is going to help you cope. No, maybe you hope the distance will help you cope. I don't love you anymore, Ben. You know, I still love you. And distance isn't going to change any of that for me. I mean, maybe it will for you, but not for me. You know, if you marrying John Reed didn't do it, nothing will. Time will. Another woman will. No, 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 Liz. Time is what you need. Time to live with John Reed and, and find out that that's, that was a big mistake all along. 
that you, you belong with me. You're as wrong as you are presumptuous. You know, I almost wish... I almost wish for your sake I were. But I'm not. That's why I'm going to be back someday. Don't. Don't even think about me, Ben. I will. Every night and every day. I love you so much, Liz. I have been called many things, Fennel, but a crossroads. Well, you see, it's you and the stationery. The stationery. Okay. Yep, everybody's just coming through. My detective license finally came through. Congratulations. Which means that I am gainfully employed. Which means that I have to set up an office. Which means that I need stationery. You need a good printer. Nope, I need a letterhead. Which means I need a corporation. Which means that I need a partner. Which means you need to know if I've decided to be your partner. Hmm? What keen powers of perception you have, my dear. See, we would make a great team. I'm sorry I haven't given you my answer yet. I just haven't really had time to think about it. Well, I could call it something ambiguous like, uh, seek em and catch em detective agency. No. You don't like it? Well, see, I've got a whole, I've got a whole list of alternatives here. Oh. I'll call it, No, uh, no, 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 that's okay. Um, I'll give you my answer in 24 hours. Really? That's great. Uh, don't feel pressured or anything. No. I mean, pressured? You? Me? Yeah. yeah. I remember each and every one of those books. Now, that's just amazing. <laughs> yeah, I do, too. I remember Siobhan teething on this guy right here. <laughs> Still has marks. <laughs> oh, happy time. Oh. I'm so glad that Grace can be a part of this and share in all this, because there's so many happy memories in this room. And now they can be hers, too. I guess everything comes full circle. Yep. Mm -hmm. You happy now? How could I not be? And you? Oh, yeah. Of course you are. I really like Conchetta. Good. I do, too. <laughs> I hope things are okay for you, generally, you know, in your new home. And no, everything. everything's fine, Pat. It's funny, I can't seem to get a fix on, you know, how you live, the, the things you do every day. I mean, there was a time when I could have guessed what you had for breakfast. Oh, it's usually instant oatmeal. I mean, it's amazing what you can do in a microwave. You got a microwave? I do. Oh, yeah. see, that's something else I didn't know about you. <laughs> really has been a long time, huh? You know, it's the longest we've ever gone without seeing one another. You know, I thought something was missing. <laughs> I guess I've always just banked on the fact that our friendship will always be there. That'll never change. You know, I was... <laughs> Sorry. You go. No, you go. I think Grace is lovely. You do? Thanks. You seem so centered. She is. It's just amazing what you can learn from a child. I can't imagine her father giving her up. Or giving you up, for that matter. We parted as friends. Did you love each other? There's never been a child conceived in more love than Grace. Then why didn't you get married? I don't know. You know, it, it just, uh, it wasn't right. I'm sorry. I mean, <laughs> doing it again, I'm trying to fill in all the black no. holes about your life. It seems like so much time has passed by, and I'm, I'm dizzy from it all. I know. Look at that. It's a whole little tower and city. How about that? Hey, why don't I build another tower, and then we can have a real New York City right here. Okay? You know, maybe we should build some luxury condos. That'd be a smart investment. What do you think? Faith, did you see the... Hello, you block builders. 
they told me I could find you here. Wow, look at that. Hey, look at that. Evan and Chris are so anxious to see you, I told them that you called them later. Mm -hmm. So, how's it going? Great. Uh, in fact, we've got to get going. Grace, honey, we've got to go home. Um, why don't you tell Pat, thanks for the uh, block. Let me help you with your coat. That's okay, you Pat, I can get it. Um, and I think her mittens are down at the We'll bag those blocks down. up for you later, okay? Good to see you. Bye, good Bye. to see you both. Bye. I'm sorry. Did I interrupt something? What could you have been interrupting? <laughs> now stay tuned for Loving.